Hey there everyone, so today I'm going to be showing you guys how to make your own Instax photos using just your phone and an AirPrint printer. So the first thing I'm doing here is opening up the Instance app and I'm just choosing a picture. And we're going to make sure that it's on this fourth layout right here so that it's uh, small enough to fit on a 4x6 photo. And you can change your filter and then you just save it. So you just save it to your photo album and then you're going to just go to PicStitch, which is another app that we'll be using. And in PicStitch, we're just going to choose the layout with the four squares. And then we're just going to change the aspect to um, the 4x6. I forgot to show you that. But uh, I have the aspect set at 4x6. And then you just um, insert all your pictures one by one in all four squares. And then you're just going to save that to your photo album. And there's a long ad, but yeah. And after that, you're just going to go to your photo album and click on that collage that we just made and click on the share button and send it to your printer. So here it is printing on my printer. I had 4x6 photo in. And now all you have to do is just cut it out one by one. So you see that there are four pictures on a four by six. So that's why we use the collage. And here I'm just cutting out each picture one by one. So there we go. There's your four photos on, on one four by six. And the way I use it is in my Foxy Dory. This is my Foxy Dory. And I have a section just for journaling. So I journal everyday moments. Yeah, so here are some of my pages that I've done so far. And yeah, so to use this, I um, to use my pictures, I use this Scotch photo slits. And I'm not exactly sure what it's called, but it's super easy. And it's so much neater than using a glue stick or double-sided tape. It's just, you just slide it on. And uh, yeah, so that's what I use. And I just stick it into my journal. And I'll, I always put the pictures first and then write afterwards because um, it's just a lot easier for me that way. Because if I were to write first, I'd probably write everywhere and there wouldn't be any room for my pictures. So yeah, so that's how I journal in my Midori. And that's how you make your own Instax photos. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial and thank you for watching.